okay so now that we know how to edit our sheet format let's talk about the title block field so on the lower right uh, section of your sheet you have a title block field so these all are the essential uh, parts or you can say essential uh, fields that we uh, have in our solidworks drawing and to we can also edit this and you can make your own custom title block but uh, for now let's talk about how we can edit this one so all you have to do is right click go to edit sheet format and uh, right click again and go to title block fields once you do that you will be given this rectangle black highlighted rectangle and you can pretty much uh, adjust this one to the area where all your title block fields are there and uh, furthermore you can see we have some blocks inside so i'll just hold on my control and click all these blocks and while i do that every time i click a block you'll see the related attribute or you can say related stuff uh, that is going to be seen so this is manufacturing approval quality approval this one is drawn date check date and all those different attributes that are related and i'll select all these and press the green tick here and then i will come out of my edit sheet format once i do that and we are in our drawing view if i hover my mouse you can see a uh, orange highlight on my uh, text block title block field and i can pretty much uh, just double click and all the uh, uh, block will be highlighted whatever the blocks that we have selected before and uh, we can edit this very easily so let's say i can do double click and put in my name let's say this one put in date something and then check by uh, senior manager and approved by senior manager and so on and so forth we can use material if you want to this is the title and revision you can put this one as a and whatever and we we want to insert we can do this over here once you are happy just press the green tick and it will be added right so that's how you can edit your title block field inside solidworks you can uh, create your own if you want to but for this tutorial i want to keep it simple so i utilize the default title block that we get inside SOLIDWORKS drawing.